Astronomy has always been a really international discipline and uh, photography is a really popular hobby all around the world so I think you put those two things together and it's a way of bringing people from all around the world together and showing that we all have this common interest and excitement in the night sky. What I find fantastic is how quite a wide community now of amateur astrophotographers are every year entering thousands of photographs in really, really deeply inventive ways and trying to push the limits both of human knowledge, of human technological achievements and of human creativity, but in very personal ways. What's interesting about this year's competition, I think, is there's been a lot of images that you've actually opened up on screen and we've, we've been discussing, and it's, it's sort of a moment where you think, well, hang on, what's going on there? What have they done? This is really interesting. I think they really get you drawn into the image and, and start thinking about what that picture actually shows. It's been a really surprising year, both in terms of numbers. We had over 4,500 entries, which is largest uh, number of entries ever, but also in terms of the creativity of our photographers. The variety of images has been quite astounding and sitting and looking at the final winners that we've chosen today, uh, it's actually such a diverse set that ranges from pure art to pure technical ability and everything in between. It's been quite an inspiring set of images this year.